previously in the last video. I can't press it! What the hell is wrong with me? And now back to the present. So th they're they're making the sequel to Paint It White, I assume. Hello, Romano. What are you doing? It looks like you're studying like a fucking nerd. Studying? No, I'm just reading. Good luck. I was only on set for my one scene in the last movie, but I heard that you sucked ass. And the only thing that saved you was good editing of your somewhat decently acted clips. Well, if I'm bad, then it's my brother's fault. I told him I didn't want to be in this damned movie, but he insisted I be in it. Huh? Why are you taking a picture of the script? I'm going to read it during the scene. Convenience. Oh, right. Don't wanna lug around that paper thing, I guess. I'm gonna go enjoy my break now. I hope you don't embarrass yourself in the next take. Thanks, I have a feeling that this next take is going to be awful. Hey, kid. Oh, Olympia! He's a baby! Oh. Oh! Hello, Mr. Romano! Ah, you have had a tip for today. Well, I've never had a job like this before. I really enjoy it. I feel like I'm really contributing a lot. Holding the boom microphone is hard work, but I feel so happy to do it. Oh, good for you then. It's being sulky and depressed. <laughs> Aw, so sweet. <laughs> oh, Latvia. Oh, hi. Vance. 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 <laughs> that Bashan is stupid audience buzz. <laughs> Why would they rate me number 10 on the popularity poll? <laughs> they have horrible taste! Yeah. Latvia- L Lithuania, are you doing okay there, man? And how damn pressure killed me up just because of fans that appreciate me! I feel you, buddy. <laughs> how horrible. Number 10 on the popularity poll. At least you're on the poll! It's almost as bad as having to work in craft services. Fresh toasted sandwiches! Ukraine! Oh, what a radiant goddess bearing food. I can now cope with my unjust disposement. I hope this doesn't come off as rude, but there seems to be a shortage of food on this table. Especially considering the size of this cast and crew. Oh, I'm sorry. It's just difficult to keep things stocked when your work partner has to keep running out of the kitchen to vomit blood in the alleyway. Lithuania! Dude, are you okay? What the f- <gasps> Yeah, I can't focus on work because of how sick I've been. I'm constantly dizzy and I've passed out a couple times. Dude, you need to take a break! Also, my lymph nodes are swollen and I keep losing feeling in my feet. Oh my god, you look awful! Have you considered seeing a doctor? Oh, a mortician? I've tried. A mortician. Russia got such shitty health insurance plans for our department that I can't find a single doctor who is covered under it. And I can't even imagine being able to pay the deductible. We're paid minimum wage! What the sh- Oh gosh. Wow. You and I. We're so- We're suffering from two equally important issues. Me with my unjust lack of screen time. And you with your housing. Dude, friends. Maybe we should do something about this. You know, start a union or something? Go on strike? Hmm. I think we should. This is meant to be a collaborative effort, but... Hard workers like us are getting shafted. At least we didn't have to prepare precious diabetic coma coffee. Hey, mind if I grab one of these? Of course not. They're made with love in every bite, so enjoy. Grazie, Bella. If you don't mind, Lithuania, France and I are going to discuss very not suspicious things in another room. We're definitely not going in strike, you see. Huh. 
Did I be concerned about that? Probably. Ah, Lithuania is too slow. No, probably not. Careful up there, kid. Oh, Hong Kong! Oh, he's light! I know, I know. I'm pretty good at this job. Do you know? Oh, stupid fucking thing! Oh, I'm glad God! Here it is. I know it's frustrating, but you don't have to kick the damn thing. Oh my gosh, she's going Super Saiyan! Take it from someone who kicks anything he runs into. It doesn't make you less angry. Hmm, angry? I'm, I'm not angry. You just started screaming at it and then kicked it. Oh no, I'm... I'm cool as a cucumber, my dude. And I never took you as a temperamental type. Reminds me of something that China would do. No, I'm not like that crocheted old man. I'm a chill dude. Look at me, I'm chill. Uh, I think I'm just uh, under a lot of pressure right now. Ah. Yeah, well. Wait, do you have gray hairs? Huh? No. Oh, really? I yeah, I noticed. I thought that was just a design choice. Christ, why is a kid like you going gray? Maybe you should stop using that damn phone. Whatever, Gramps. I just wish Prussia didn't make me the sole gaffer. I'd have time in a day to vet my frustration by team killing a bunch of 13 year olds in military squadron too. Are you sure those games aren't what's making you more angry? No offense, but I think your retirement home could benefit from having a game console in it. <laughs> Little brat! Of the next light falls on him. Did I just wish death upon a child? <laughs> Wish death upon this teenager for being too trendy. Hey, look, I'm dancing on here. Okay. So that's the set piece. And let's talk to Prussia here. Hey, old Romano. You're rather enthusiastic. Enthusiastic? No. Antsy, yes. And what bright hell is making you antsy? My coffee. I like need it. It's hardly coffee. I'd call that a milkshake with a dash of coffee. He's a way I need it. My blood sugar is kind of fucked, so if I don't get enough sugar, I get all agitated and dizzy, and I get migraines and health heart palpitations. Also, if I don't get enough caffeine, I get bitchy. I can kind of understand how you feel. Pretty much, my bl sir, my blood is just sixty percent Arabica at this point. I drink it. No! Damn, I just want China to come back with my drink. I'm getting really impatient. Maybe you shouldn't add like 50 different dollops of stuff in there then. To be fair, he does have to run like two miles away. And he's really old. Yeah, but he's got a lot of speed for his age. Hell, he can run faster than I can. Why don't you just ask one of the craft services people to make you a coffee? They can't do it right. Just a face those people to the cafe to it makes it taste so yummy. So whatever you say, but if you ever want real coffee, come to my country. Not because I intend to. I need me a vacay after all of this hard work of filming and directing for all of these months. Wink. What? Why did they say wink but then not wink? Wink. I'm gonna go see him. <laughs> He's lost it. Maybe we should leave this hallway for last. Okay. Go the opposite way then. Oh, security cam. Jeez, who's taking a smoke break? Kiku? Ugh. Hmm? Do you need something? Japan! I never took you as a smoker. I only really smoke when I'm a... Very stressed. Oh, I get you. That explains where you run off to whenever we take five. And, uh, all these empty cartridges aren't yours, right? They are. Jeez, you're not a slob. What the hell's the mess for? Hey, why aren't you in the Painted White movie? Japan, weren't you in the first one? I know it's a mess, but I don't have enough time between takes to clean it up. 
usually stay late the day before garbage day, picking up the curtains. But they collect garbage once a week? Yes. You spoke this many a week? Mm. Jesus, your bullet's probably just a bunch of black paste. Would you like one, Romano? No thanks, I'm trying to clean that actually. It must be difficult. Eh, not really. You just put on those patches whenever you feel an itch. Yes, but I imagine having to limit yourself is... HOLY F- uh, That's one way to do it, I suppose. I could never quit. That was pressure with- I, I skipped accidentally, sorry. I hate to complain. I can't handle being the only cameraman. You're the only camera dude! Uh, not much I can do about that. I don't know shit about cameras. Jeez, they should have gone for something lower budget if they don't have much staff. But uh, just believe in yourself? Like a, I don't know, some a low budget gem like Saw that took place in a single room? I don't really know how to cheer you up. I'm not a cheery up guy. Maybe we can go out for drinks tonight to give you a chance to unwind? Oh, uh, I suppose I could. Maybe I'll teach you how to talk to the ladies, yeah? Wing wing? By the way, I don't have enough money to pay for both of us. Yes, I know. You usually don't. Anyways, I'm gonna leave you be for now. Yeah, maybe Japan's freaking the fuck out. This poor fucking lungs. Jeez. <laughs> you know, I'm just smoking the, the burns as usual. Is that the blood that Lithuania freaking vomited? I might as well try to meet more of the crew. I'm making all of the smart people shit for the movie after all. Huh, it's locked. Uh-oh. The trash. And rooms! This is Francis' dressing room. Or well, it used to be, actually. Maybe I won't have to share a room with my dumbass brother anymore then. <laughs> What's wrong? Uh, oh, it's nothing. It's nothing. Nothing's wrong. Just fucking tell me instead of being all stinky about it. He took away practically all of my lines. Yeah, he told you that before. But, but, that's me on the front of the poster. But now I barely duck at all. Oh yeah, you're only there for star power. <laughs> you said you were too distracting. I'm not too distracting. Whatever, drama queen. Yeah, I'm so angry. So, so angry. You have way more lands than I do. So what? Acting isn't only about dialogue, eggs for brains. You'd know that if you even remotely cared about acting. I'm just gonna do something else. Your bitching and whining is too annoying for me to want to engage. So long, brother. How are you doing? Uh, Russia? Good day, little Romano. Uh, hi. Let me ask you something. How do you cope with having fans? What do you mean? I have been checking social medias, yeah? Exercising due diligence and researching what our director wants. And these people are drawing pictures of me, calling me sweet names like a pet, and making entire accounts dedicated to me. It really makes me flustered. I do not know what to say nor why these people like me so much. Oh. I don't know why they do that. I don't really go on websites like that. I was going to ask how you cope with being called a sexy feral garbage king. As that seems to be a recurring theme among your fans. I don't call him that. What does that mean? I am not sure. I think some of these people have serious mental issues that they need to iron out and cope with using comfort characters. Including me. I accidentally stumbled upon some art of a special variety. Oh no! I'm not sure why people would draw such obscene things. And of our friends, no less. Very odd. The weirdest part is that they apparently know about your brother's condition. Huh? I 
have no clue where they would get this information from. But I would suggest covering your laptop camera with some tape, just to be careful. Oh yeah, I do that, but I also do it because like since we're I'm using Zoom, it's just like I don't want to accidentally have the camera be on and for people to see me and just like my face when it's not like makeup enough or something. I anywho I'm going to continue my research. Hopefully I will not stumble any more naked people. They're pretty brave for taking that risk. Just don't look at the slash fan fiction. Be safe. Oh come on! Hello, Milano. You need help with something? Nah, just taking a walk around to clear my head before we film the next scene. Right, right. You're pulling a face. What's wrong? You sick or something? Just, uh, kind of concerned about the direction Prussia gave me. Yeah, I don't like that direction at all. What, the wimp thing? Yeah, I've been trying to figure out how to properly read, lead, read and place inflection on in some of the dialogue in the new script and... It's a challenge. It can't be that hard. All you have to do is act like a fraidy cat. I mean, it's kind of easy for me. Ah! Act like you always do in real life, yeah? I'm not a coward, Kuma Cracker. At least, not even remotely in the way the script shows. I'd say that you're afraid to stand up for yourself. But I wouldn't call you a total wimp. Can't be that different. He would have needed to completely rewrite the script. There's no way he had time to do that. Ha have you read it? No. Well, let me tell you, he has way too much time. Go eat a sandwich, and then come back to it with a fresh mind. Or maybe eat ten sandwiches, then come back to it. That's a lot of s sandwiches! <gasps> I'm sorry, I just read his... That's a lot of sandwiches, Kuma Booby. Why? I'd probably throw up if I ate that many. See yourself. I want Sammy's. Aw, so cute. You're so precious, Kuma. Oh, this is going to be so embarrassing. Eh, can't be that bad. It's just a movie and you're an actor. But this new Canada is so unlike me. He's a complete pushover. And he stutters and blushes everywhere. Sounds not very different. But like, in a really, really, really pushovery way. And he's not even a little bit manly. And sounds to me like you think that be not being manly doesn't make you a man. It's just the least manly thing you could ever fucking think! I wasn't trying to imply that, I was just... So what if you like pink stuff or whatever? So what if you like flowery scented bath soaps? So what if you like the way that high heels make your legs go from not to hot in a matter of seconds? And live with a feeling of smooth nylon stockings against your freshly shaved legs? And that argan oil infused cream with gentle lavender oil infusion that make your legs buttery smooth like the calves of Venus herself? You're not still a fucking man! You know, you might need to walk outside for a second. I don't know how to respond to that. Turns out they're in the free course in ditching toxic masculinity, kid. Next time you need advice, I'll judge. Er, okay. Thank you? Oh, they got multiple dialogues for him. Cool, I gotta go back and talk to the other people. What's up, my badder? Leave me alone! Come back someone else! Okay, well, fuck you too. I just wanted some cool new dialogue, but I guess not. Mm, seems Prussia did not include some changes that I had thought he would. What do you mean? He said that my fans find an accent and improper grammar endearing. And I think Philippine said that. But he didn't rewrite my lines to include any grammar issues. I suppose he wants me to do this on my own, ad-libbing and whatnot, but this will be a challenge. Agami like, can just talk like you're still learning English. But it is difficult to do that naturally, for me anyways. I make mistakes with English sometimes, but I have never tried to pretend that I don't speak it. I don't suppose you could help me. Is my English that bad? 
no, I ask you because you are a good actor. You think I'm a good actor? Indeed, friend. Aw, he's such a sweetheart outside of the movie. Oh, uh, thanks, I guess. So, any advice? Uh, I guess think about what you would say in your language and then translate it directly? Ah, oh, yes, so I should remove all articles? Does your language do that? Yes, I know that must be a terrifying concept for you. Hmm? What are articles? It is. I guess you should do that then. Also, there are some prepositions and articles here and there in the wrong places. Maybe fuck up a couple verb conjunctions for good measure. And I think Prussia would want you to really ham up your actions. And rolling your R's really hard and stuff. Yes, yes, very good. I will take note of all of those things. Thank you for your help. No problem. Please remember this act of kindness for me if you're ever under the verge of snapping me in half like a twig. Oh, I would never do that. Intentionally. <laughs> Oh fuck, are you just getting changed in here? I'll just leave. No, no, don't leave. I need your help. <laughs> You're shirtless, no. Uh, I gotta be hunky and stuff, and that's just like not my style, dude. I'm more of a charming and nerdy, but also jockey enough to not be a total dweeb type. Not a supermodel. I need advice. And well, you're not really hunky either. But at this point, I'm desperate. I have to slap you. Please, just any trip or trick will work. Ah, fine. I'll give you a brief masterclass in being an Italian, huh? Firstly, you're going to need to practice your sexy face. What's a sexy face? It's when you relax the muscles around your mouth, squint your eyes a bit, straighten out your forehead and purse your lips slightly. Oh, so like the face you make when you're dropping a log? You might be a lost cause. No, 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 I'll try it! <sighs> Is my face sexy? Close! Oh, my face isn't even the only problem! I don't know how to get this physique right! Most models completely cut out carbs and saturated fats. So that's probably a good place to start. Okay, what are those? Bread, pasta, pastries, ice cream, anything with butter in it, chocolate, processed meats, anything fried, anything with sugar in it. What the shit? So, no food? Uh, you can have a salad? Oh good, Caesar salad. Not Caesar, the dressing's bad for you, not to mention the croutons. You can only have a plain one with some veggies in it. Oh, come on! Sorry, I don't make the rules of food, nor do I make the rules of conventionally attractive body types. Oh, I just guess for the movie, so I guess I'll just eat like a rabbit for the time being. Oh no. No, America, no! Hey, America! Oh, hey, Phil, what's up? I have some important info for you regarding the stuff in your script change. There is a bit of an issue. I didn't check out that new script. What's up? Well, you know how I talked about the popular fanfiction earlier? Yeah, something something kiss from a nation on a grave. No, I think you're confusing it with another fanfiction. It's a nation's 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 world. But I could digress. I was referring to all of the nations who rose never boomed. A really famous fanfic that has become the backbone of the entire fandom. You see... I studied this fic, re read and reread it countless times, and reported every important detail to Prussia. So you know how you were depicted as a very hunky and sexy archetype, right? Yeah. And you know how I said there were also some other things of note about your character in the fic? But I assumed there would be no full frontal nudity in the sequel so they're not relevant. Oh no, there's nudity. I do remember you saying those exact words. Yeah, so... Apparently Prussia added a lot of full frontal nudity to the script. <gasps> Wait, what?! He thought it was a good idea. He said it would act thematic and artistic significance to the movie, while also appealing to fans. I don't want to get naked in front of a camera! 
No, no, he just added it for America. No one else. Oh shit. That's where the warning about the censored nudity comes from. <laughs> I'd recommend you study the fic. It really gives insight into how the fans see you. I'd advise you start ASAP. The fic is 35 chapters long. Oh, come on, I have to read. Sorry, man, that's showbiz or something. Are you illiterate or something? I'd explain how badly you bought your lines. I can read. I just choose not to. Uh, I wish I could stay in chat, but I gotta go. Crusher wants me to do constant social media promos, so I've got a tight schedule. I texted you to fit. Good luck. Well, now I gotta keep three things in mind. Sexy face, salad, and I have to show my butt. <laughs> Should be too hard. I get naked in the shower every day. Can't say I don't admire your confidence. Good luck with the flashing everyone. I'm so hungry. I can't eat any of the stuff at the craft services table because it's all loaded with butter. Could you go get something for me? What am I, a fucking servant? No, but you're my cool friend who knows I'm suffering. <sighs> I'll go get something for you. Oh, goodbye, sweet, sweet french fries. Okay, where are you, England? Oh, he's got tea. Hey, what are you up to? Reading the script. I want to familiarize myself with the changes. Russia told me to cut down on the ad-libbing and be more emotional. So I have to figure out how to fit his vision. Well, good luck with that. Wait, you're rather emotional. Can you give me any pointers? Is that meant to be an insult? No, just a plain observation. Uh, well, I really can't help improve your acting in any way. I'm no acting coach. The thing is, I also feel like s there's some cases where, like, if a movie is bad and the characters are bad at aren't acted well, like, it could also end up being the director's fault because the director's direction wasn't, like, I don't know, in a way that could work out well. How you see some actors, they do well in certain movies, and in, in others, they just do horribly, it seems. I'm already an experienced actor. That's not my issue. I went to school for theater, remember? Oh, you have a degree? Uh, I took a handful of classes. But I just need help with crying on cue. My brother is a crybaby. Maybe he can help you? Not a bad idea. I'll go talk to him once I've caught up with the script changes. He's probably just bitching anyway. <laughs> okay, I guess that's it. Oh wow, this department needs some help. Jeez, literally no one touched the salad so far. Oh well, more for America. Here's some veggies. They'll hold you over for a while. Thanks, Romano. You're the best. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Okay, so I assume that... I'm done? So far as this area goes, so I think I'll try to see if I can go the other hallway. Hey, I have access here now.